Hello my friend, in this video I'd like to share my process of colored pencil drawing. These are very short clips taken with my phone as I kept uh, working on my painting. I plan my compositions in Photoshop. I move elements around to arrive at the best composition I can get to illustrate my idea. Then I transfer the image and start uh, shading everything in one color only. I focus on the deepest shadows or darkest darks uh, to shade everything in one color. And after that, I begin layering colors uh, quite slowly. I usually take another color and start adding it around my drawing. And if I draw on white paper or white surface, I mark uh, my lighter areas with, with a very light um, yellowish or cream colored pencil. I basically shade around that light area just a little bit to make sure that I don't color it uh, by accident. I usually leave more space than I need because I can always make it smaller but if I uh, shade everything and cover the highlight it's very difficult to recover it. I also did some paper indenting in the beginning of my shading process and uh, you can see that my lines begin showing through as I keep shading over them. Drawing in colored pencil is a very laborious uh, process and it takes weeks to complete one drawing of this size. So there are many uh, days and weeks in between when it's just uh, shading one small area uh, to fill it in. And the subjects that I draw are, are not simple references. I usually combine different sources to articulate my uh, basic idea. Uh, for instance, I can take uh, pictures of trees and I took uh, the picture of a classical wing somewhere in Rome. Then I had a few pictures of mushrooms and uh, you know, separate pictures of different birds and I combined all of that into one drawing to uh, create a unique environment. I always try to use different tools to help me draw. Uh, for instance, if I need to draw a round shape, I don't want to struggle, so I use uh, the tools to help me with that. And to make any surface colorful, I basically layer the same colors over and over again in different uh, combinations. So I might have three or five colored pencils, but I layer them continuously and that's how I build up contrast and color variety. You can see me working uh, with the blade. Um, if you decide to try it, be very careful because uh, you can do scratching by rotating the blade at, and holding it at a particular level, not to scratch the paper, but just the pigment uh, that you've previously applied.
If you'd like to learn more about colored pencil drawing, go to my website veronikasart.com and click on video courses at the top menu and then just follow the links there to uh, pick the right class for you. And thank you so much for watching guys, I appreciate that very much. Take care, bye-bye.